What is Slick YouTube? This is Juan from the Gamers Ministry, and today is February 15th, 2012, and the footage that we're watching is from December 29th, 2011. Now let's Malik. talk to Malik. Come to waste more of my time? I've found Talal. I'm ready to begin my mission. That is for me to decide. Very well. Here's what I know. He traffics in human lives, kidnapping Jerusalem citizens and selling them into slavery. His base is a warehouse located inside the Barbican, north of here. As we speak, he prepares a caravan for travel. I'll strike while he's inspecting his stock. If I can avoid his men, Talal himself should prove little challenge. Little challenge? Listen to you. Such arrogance. Are we finished? Are you satisfied with what I've learned? No. But it will have to do. Rest, prepare, cry in the corner. Do whatever it is you do before a mission. Only make sure you do it quietly. Man, Malik is just never gonna let us, you know, live that down. I mean, Fast he, he, he did, he fun. did lose his left arm and his brother <laughs> because Altair just messed up. Man, truth be told, I don't want to mess or, you know, waste any time in this episode. So, Altair, be ready and teleport! Nice teleport there, I'll tell you. <laughs> nah, we just we just cut forward towards Talal's base. But hmm, it seems like he was expecting us. They just closed the door as soon as we got him. We. What now, slaver? Do not call me that. I only wish to help them, as I myself was helped. You do no kindness imprisoning them like this. Imprisoning them? I keep them safe. Preparing them for the journey that lies ahead. What journey? It is a life of servitude. <laughs> you know nothing. It was folly to even bring you here. To think that you might see and understand. I understand well enough. Show yourself. Help me. Save me. Ah, so you want to see the man who called you here. You did not call me here. I came on my own. Creepy. Did you? Who unbarred the door? Clearly. Did you once raise your blade against a single man of mine, huh? Step into the light, then. And I will grant you. Now I stand before you. What is it you desire? Come down here. Let us settle this with honor. Why must it always come to violence? It seems I cannot help you, for you do not wish to help yourself. And I cannot allow my work to be threatened. You leave me no choice. You must die. Oh, great. <laughs> Well, this is the one thing about this mission. There is, there is no guarantee on on this mission. You need to fight these guys. Like, there is no way to, you know, get Talal and fight him. At least that I know of. There's no way to fight him without, you know, without having any, you know, without him noticing and sneaking up, on, sneaking up on him in a stealthy way. But well, pretty much just take care of the guards and like <laughs> I'll tell you, Aaron and Lisa, his. Take, you know, if you can get past the guards, he should be a little worse. Oh god, why am I my counters are not working? I'm I'm sucking very bad today. Okay. Oh you god, you guys are making me mad. Why do you keep sneaking up on me? Now I got two bars of health left. It's not looking good. And where do you come from? And why isn't guard break working? I thought guard break I already had guard break. I'm guessing I missed red. Okay. Oh! Oh God, I'm not doing good. This is not a good spot to be in. Okay, let's let's okay. Boom! Another one down. Okay, two more to go. Two more to go. Okay, let's focus, man. Let's focus. Yeah! Another one down. Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, what? Another one? Come on. Okay. Okay. Let's just focus one. Come on. Keep it. Another one. God. Okay. Three down. Three down. And two more that just came up. 
Okay, let's just take these guards, man. These second-rate guards. You guys suck. You guys suck. Let's do this. Oh, it's almost, almost. Okay, you're down. Now it's just okay. You got hit me, but now I'll take care of you. Bam! There you go. You got no legs anymore. Okay, oof. Okay, okay. Guard break's not working. God. Okay. Dude, I got you. I got you. Okay. One, two. There you go. There you go. You're dead. Oof. Well, yes. A lot of senseless bloodshed in order to take down one slave trader. Man, this guy is just like the ultimate wrecking machine. Keep him away from me. Oh, you scared now, boy? Come on. Come back here. I'll take care of you. Okay, let's just go after him all tight here. Oh, dude. Come on. No more guards. Okay, come on. Let's just take care of this guy. I wish I had used a short blade. Okay, here. Oh, yeah. I was about to use a short blade after that. But I didn't get a chance to. Okay. Now, where is this guy? Oh, there he is. Okay, let's go after him. Let's go, Altair. Come on, jump like a crazy man. Yeah. Let's do this, man. Let's do this. Let's go after him. Bring out your hidden blade. Oh, oh, the hidden man. The long, the 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 throwing knives didn't do anything. Oh well. Okay, let's do this. Just focus on him. Forget the rest of the guys. Just yeah, focus on him, and just try to kill him in in a uh, high profile mode where that means that you will be just jumping on him. Oh, ow! Come on, just, just focus, just focus, let's go. We're after this guy, after this guy, after this guy. Let's not give him a second chance. Oh, he... Yes! You've nowhere to run now. Share your secrets with me. My part is played. The Brotherhood is not so weak that my death will stop its work. What Brotherhood? Al-Mu'alim is not the only one with designs upon the Holy Land. And that's all you'll have from me. Then we are finished. Beg forgiveness from your god. He's long abandoned us. Long abandoned the men and women I took into my arms. What do you mean? Beggars, whores, addicts, lepers. Do they strike you as proper slaves? Unfit for even the most menial tasks? No. I took them not to sell, but to save. And yet you'd kill us all. For no other reason. Than it was asked of you. No, you profit from the war, from lives lost and broken. Yes, you would think that, ignorant as you are. Wall off your mind, eh? They say it's what your kind do best. Do you see the irony in all this? No, not yet, it seems. But you will. Oh man, good thing that lady was there to be an obstacle for him. That kind of slowed him down and we got a good chance to jump on him. Um, anyway, he just said that God long abandoned us. And for the lore of Assassin's Creed, that is true. You'll find, so you'll find out much later. But, um, but according, but I mean, for, for real life purposes, God has not abandoned us. Um, he's there if you look for him, if you search for him, if you try to develop a relationship with him. God is there. He never abandoned you. It's just humans abandon him. They, I mean, nobody likes to be told. For example, for all the, for all the, uh, let's just say, for example, let's just let's take sex addicts for example. Nobody wants to be told. No sex addict wants to be told. Hey, you need to stop all with all the promiscuity to having sex with all these random women. You know, you need to have some real values. Nobody wants to be told that. So they turned their back on God. Altair. Wonderful to see you return to us. Really? And how fared the mission? The deed is done. Yeah. Talal is dead. Oh, I know, I know. In fact, the entire city knows. Uh -oh. Have you forgotten the meaning of subtlety? He was being a sarcastic. skilled assassin ensures his work is noticed by the many. <laughs> no, a skilled assassin maintains control of his environment. We can argue the details all you'd like, Malik. But the fact remains, I've accomplished the task set to me by Al Mu'allim. Go then. Return to the old man. Let us see with whom he sides. You and I are on the same side, Malik. You mean on the right side, because he has no left side? <laughs> Good, no harm. <laughs> oh, poor Malik. I'll tell you, come on, man. He's, he's, he might have a grudge with you for the rest of his life. He did lose his left arm and his brother because of you. Remember that, buddy. Remember that. Damn it! What's the problem now? 
I'm getting weird temperature readings. I think the Animus is overheating. Christ, it's always something! How long? Too soon to tell. These delays are unacceptable, Miss Stillman. I want progress reports every hour. It's gonna be a while, Desmond. Why don't you go lie down or something? Get some rest. Where is Vidic going? Hmm. Wow, that's a very shiny light beyond those doors. I wonder if we'll ever make it through those doors. Hmm. Why is he always yelling at you? It's his machine. His theories. He's not the one who built it. Who did? You? <laughs> no. Abstergo has a team of engineers. Not much they don't have. But I did oversee the assembly. Guess that's why he gets so angry with me. He's a He's under a lot of pressure. We all are. I can't believe you're defending the guy. Warren saved my life, so if he wants to yell a little, let him. What do you mean he saved your life? You're not the only one who doesn't get to go home at night. Wait, are you saying you're a prisoner? When they first approached me, I was finishing up my PhD. The university had made it clear I had no future there. They didn't like the subject of my doctorate, called it pseudoscience. Said keeping me on would discredit and embarrass them. It was the same everywhere. Other universities, companies I interviewed with. Pretty soon I was out of money and out of time. I was this close to waiting tables. Then I got a letter. From Vidic? He said he'd been following my career since undergrad. That he believed in my work and wanted to meet to discuss my future. You have no idea how good it felt to hear that. So I met with him. What did I have to lose? And he offered you a job? Yes, here at Abstergo. Helping out on the Animus Project. I'd have a chance to test my theories and prove the professors wrong. How could I turn that down? I think I'm missing the part where you became a prisoner. Sometimes I wonder if they weren't behind it all. If they manipulated events so that I'd get desperate. They can do that. They can do anything. I didn't think when I agreed to come here. They even told me I'd be trapped. For six months, a year max. Once the product launched, there'd be no need for secrecy anymore. But until then, I'd be a guest of the company. At least, that's what they said. And when the Animus was ready? They came in while I was sleeping. Three guys. Guns. They dragged me out of bed. God. The worst part is I knew them. One guy, Richard, we ate lunch together sometimes. And now he was gonna... They were cracking jokes. I tried to pull away. He hit me. And that's when he told me I was going to die. Christ, what did you Nothing. do? Nothing. I kept telling myself it wasn't real. And then Warren was there, shouting at them to get away from me. And they listened. Jesus. He's not a happy man, Desmond. I wouldn't even say he's a good man, but he saved my life. They never came for me again. And he promised they never would. You're still stuck here working for these nutjobs. But I'm alive. Anyway, I really do need to get the Animus repaired. I'll see you tomorrow, Desmond. Okay, well we're approaching the end of the video, yeah, and Lucy has nothing more to say, so with that I'll just say God bless you guys and I'll see you next vid. What the hell? Someone's been in here. What? What's in there? Looks like some kind of access code. Well, something's fishing going on, and let's just find out about that in the next video. See you guys.